What's up, guys? We're doing a little test here. Sundown audio on the test bench. We've got some Excess Power caps hooked up. Got our little fancy Full River charger down there. So we got five cells wired in series. Got them charged up to right at 15 volts. This is the only thing powering our SCV 4000. And we're going to do a quick uncertified dyno run at 1 ohm. And here we go. Going to see how much power we can get uncertified on the amp dyno from one bank of excess power caps. So it is running and we are at 3,685 watts. And that's from one bank of caps. I didn't quite see what it dropped to over here on this side. About nine volts. Uh, so we dropped about nine on this end, and it looks like we're chilling at 10.5 right now. Did you want to right. fix the voltage? <laughs> nah, I'm gonna leave it. So, guys, one thing I want to uh, make sure and point out here: so the voltage we're showing on our cap or our amp dyno is uh, still plugged in back here at our normal test bank. So it's reading off these batteries down here, not reading off what we're seeing. So we're gonna do another quick run. I'm a video of the voltage drop you're going to see here. Just know it's not going to be the same as what's shown on the screen. I just don't feel like rewiring the whole, the whole bench to, because uh, we don't care about the amp dyno and voltage, and we're just testing out the cap banks. So we're just waiting on this to get back up to 15 volts. Then we're going to hit it. I'm going to record the voltage drop. So yeah, Let's see how close we're getting. up here oh uh, whatever close enough let's make sure I get that on film so we're at 15 volts I'm starting the amp dyno so you're gonna get to watch the volts tank that's it it's it like stopped the, about 12 2 so the amp dyno is over. You got to see how bad the volts dropped. And we got 3,788 watts out of that uncertified at one ohm. And that's off one bank of five cells of excess power caps. SCV 4000. All right, guys, here we go. Get started on the next test. So we have the SCV 4000 amplifier. We got the amp dyno ready to go on our uncertified run. Just remember that the voltage you see here is still reading off our old power bank down there. The voltages we're going to read here are plugged right into the power and ground coming off of this bank. Do uh, you want to tell us something about that bank? Uh, it's made by Skeleton Technologies and it's supposed to be 3800 farad. Uh, so it should be a little bit a little bit more powerful, but we'll see. It's all laser welded and fancy. So for anybody that doesn't know, this is Matt from Full Throttle. And we're at 15 volts. So we're going to start the amp dyno. Now it's running. I'm trying to make sure I got this in good. There we go. So y'all can watch this voltage as it runs. Are we running over there? You didn't plug the remote back in. Ah, uh, <laughs> fail. Got to plug the remote back in. Our amp's not even on. Hold on. All right, my goof. Amp's on. Lights on. We're starting the amp dyno. Watching the voltage. Get there. There we go. SCV 4000 off this bank. Amp dyno 3932 watts uncertified at 1 ohm. Um, Alright, guys, take two. We got the amp dyno reset. SCV 4000. And this time we're going to read current. So here we go. Try to get 
this in. So we can see current draw coming from this cap bank as well as the voltage drop. And this time we got 3,897 watts. Uncertified dyno run at one ohm. All from one single bank of caps. So let me know what you think, guys. All right, guys, we're doing a third run. We're going to really beat it up. We're doing uncertified at 0.8. So the amp dyno is running. We're going to watch voltage and current draw over here. Uncertified, 4,262 watts.